It's that time of year again, the old springtime, where all you want to do is clean up the areas that you work around most. A little spring cleaning. I got the bug and decided to build myself something special for my chainsaw. I wanted to build a little holder that would hold my chainsaw in a normal position as if it was sitting on a counter. I figure this will help the oil from leaking out and it might look pretty cool on the wall. So let's get building. As you can see here, I've got a base. That base is where the chainsaw will actually sit. Now that square tubing, I'm gonna eventually notch a hole in it and the actual bar of the chainsaw will fit right through there. That'll keep it from falling off the shelf. Eventually, I'll have a mounting bracket on the back that I will mount to the wall and a little special something in the front. Now that I've got the square tubing that's going to be the bar holder welded to the base, I can cut the slot for the bar to fit through. If I would have known the exact dimensions and exactly how I was going to build this whenever I started it, I would have actually made this cut prior to welding it. It would have been a lot easier, but that's okay. I'll just use my grinder and my Dremel. Great, now that I've got the main components built for this mount, I can build this little special piece that I'm gonna put in the front, and then I can also build the part that's gonna to mount to the wall. Just need to clean up this steel, and then I'll be ready to weld it on. As I told you guys before, I'm new to welding, but this is the best weld I've ever done. I was pretty proud of it. I was only sad that it's on the back of the project. Alright, now that we're done welding, I just need to clean it off. This front part's more important because this is actually going to be a spot where I'm going to put a little logo. I think it'll look pretty neat and make this whole project really unique. Okay, now I just need two simple holes that I can put some lag bolts through to mount it to a stud on the wall. Super easy using my new drill press. Time for a little paint. Yelp, orange. You either love it or you hate it. But you know what? 
a still chainsaw is going on here and their signature color is orange. So it's gotta happen. Now to add something a little special. All right, now it's time to hang it on the wall. Just need to find a stud, make sure that it's level, and then mount it to the wall. There it is, mounted to the wall, ready to go. I'm really happy with how it turned out. I even have a spot for my chainsaw tool. Pretty handy. Now, let's see if the saw fits. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope it inspired you to make something for your garage. Don't forget, subscribe, like, leave me a comment, let me know what you think. And as always, run, bike, and just have fun. We'll see you in the next one.